Hi Aquarius, it's L here to do your September 2018 general reading. Now it's a general reading so it will not resonate with everyone who views the video, but if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Make sure you're commenting below so you can be entered to win for next month's um, free reading drawing. Okay? Um, so let's get started. I have shuffle and prayed over the cards off camera. Thank you to those who like, share, and comment. Um, okay, yeah, I think that's it for the announcement. Uh, Aquarius, some of my Aquarius are in love. I mean, like, real love. Real love with someone. Some of them, the people you're in love with, they hurt you in the past, or you hurt them, or whatever. Um... Some of the people that you're in love with may be partner right now and trying to get out of something. Um, some of you are waiting um, <clears throat> or vice versa. They're waiting for you, Aquarius. The Empress and the King of Water fall out. Okay, some of it, it could be a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, male, female. Okay. And then we have the Four of Air and then the Lovers. Someone's taking some time to decide who and what they really want. Really meditating on making this change, this life-altering change. Okay, so with the lovers, it's the angel spirit brings two people together or back together. And it's what you do in that bringing back together or, or bringing together. It's still free will. Spirit is working here and bringing, you know, two souls together. But what are you going to do, Aquarius? What is the other party going to do? It could be a Gemini. Um, there might be a period of separation for the two of you. Someone had to travel. Someone left. Someone lives far over water, overseas. Six of water. Yes. It's someone from your past. Someone you have a past with. Someone you may have children with. Someone who you have very fond memory of. Someone who you feel like is a soulmate. Very well could be. Let's see. The magician, the hermit. Wow, these fell out off camera. Um, in seclusion, in self reflection, you're able to manifest. Or vice versa for the person that you've come to the reading for. You're able to manifest the two of water, the two of cups. The coming together, the mutual beneficial relationship, the successful relationship. The time apart is not, um, it's temporary. It's not, you know, it's not a finality there. It's just that some of my Aquarians need to get some things together. Or who you're dealing with, they need to get some things together. Um, so, hey, you know, take that time to make it right. What do the cards have to tell Aquarius for career finance? Career finance for Aquarius. Career finance for Aquarius. Under the deck, the Four of Swords, meditation, prayer, arrest, arresting of the mind brings clarity, truth, new idea, rest. Right. The lovers, the Three of Pentacles, the Five of Swords, the Queen of Cups. Aquarius, uh, your fortune. Your fortune may be wrapped up in a life partnership, in who you decide to partner with. There is interference in, in between getting to said person, Queen of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer in particular. It doesn't have to be, it could be anybody here, it could be Gemini. 
Um, there needs to be a choice, an active choice of who will you partner with. There is in indecision and there's interference to get here or get to this person. Um, now it may be interference on your part, Aquarius, or interference on the other um, the other person's behalf. They may already be partnered. They've got to make a choice. Once again, we've got some of the same cards coming up in a different deck. They're trying. You're fortunate. I clearly asked for career and finance. Whatever is happening in career and finance is definitely. Um, there's a large impact of what's happening in relationship to once you figure out life partnership in regards to romantic relationship the career and finance will will follow suit it will flow it will it will be better for you once you figure out who you are partnering with your fortune is tied up into with someone else air sign gemini libra aquarius Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Hmm. Interesting. Let's see if we can get a different spread. Maybe there are some Aquarius out there going through something a little bit different. What are, are any additional messages for Aquarius? Any additional messages for Aquarius for September 2018? The magician. September 2018. This looks like a month of kind of chilling and waiting. So it's like the ball is in someone else's court. Don't take that as if you have no say, no power, or you're not getting what you want. It's just more so somebody else has to clear something up. Or you, of course. You've gotten clear on what on on things that have happened in your life and how you manifested them, and you're very clear on how to manifest. Um, someone came back from the past. I think you got clear on what someone or something meant to you, and vice versa. The bottom of the deck we have strength. Be strong in dealing with this situation because someone is um, trying to give you that emotional offer, have that reconciliation with you. Um, for some of you it's a Gemini another Aquarius Cancer Pisces Scorpio you've gotten clear on what this person means to you even a Leo Sun Moon or Rising wow strength and will of fortune be strong in, in knowing be strong in knowing that this is for you it's meant for you Changes are taking place in your life, but you have to be strong enough to see that you have to go through to get to. Mm, write it down. Page of sword. There may be uh, some cutting away or cutting off. There might be short communication. There might be even someone spying on you. Maybe a younger air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. They were a fool or are a fool or they want to be like the fool and find happiness with you. They're waiting for communication with you, waiting for the opportunity to partner with you. Somebody wants to be your husband or wife, then the, then the hair, heart, hair font follows. Yeah, They find balance with you. They find equality with you. They're coming to you and giving you that communication that this is what they find with you. Wow, the Empress and then the Star card. You are their wish fulfillment. You are abundant. You are beautiful inside and out. You are radiant. You radiate positivity. You've built a throne in the midst of nothing. Every other queen in the deck sits on a throne made for her. The Emperor sits on a throne in the midst of wilderness, meaning I had nothing and now I have all of these things. I waited for no one to give me anything and now I am desired. Not because I am so great, but because of 
the positivity and the radiance and the abundance that I have within myself and that I create for myself and I'm willing to share it with those who um, mutually benefit me and then the Ten of Pentacles after it. A lot of you are concerned about long-term stability. A lot of you are um, more concerned about who you're going to partner with, who you're going to share this with. A lot is going good for you. Right? You're looking at the past. Aquarius, it looks good. It looks like you might even have several different offers. There might be some, a few suitors. I think Aquarius knows who they want, though, but they're still keeping options open because somebody else has to clear something up. Let's get some angel answers in here. So if you have questions out there, here are the answers. All right. Formulate your questions now. Here we go. All right. <laughs> Okay, that was fast. I hope they, it's good. Listen to your intuition. Romance, if you believe. What? This is nice. Um, So there are your answers at the bottom of the deck. Improving health. If that is a concern of yours, no longer let it be. Uh, improving health is here for you. Okay. Listen to your intuition. That's hard for an Aquarius to do. Think, 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 go to sleep, wake up, think about it some more, drink, think. And then you say, you know what? I don't want to think about this no more. I'm done with this person. I'm cutting them off. <laughs> Woo. Don't that make a lot of sense? No. Okay. We got two that just fell out and then one more. Okay, let's go. Butterfly Oracle. Spiritual growth, nice. Listen to your intuition. Definitely been heightened for me. Um, and I know a few other Aquarian readers. Okay. Take the next step. Nice. Retirement. What did I say? A lot of you are concerned about long-term stability. You're concerned about your, um, of course, actual retirement. Get some rest. We had the Four of Swords come out a lot. A lot of you going through some things, some, some changes, some big shakeups and some changes, but some goodness is on the way. Uh, also it talks about the change of job, the shift in job, um, actual retirement, or now you can do your job with less hours and still maintain yourself in your life. Um, retiring an old way of uh, in, you know gaining income. It may be that you did 40 plus hours a week. Uh, now you can do 20 or less and still uh, be be great you know um aquarius if this resonated with you please like share comment subscribe to the channel it's much appreciated make sure you're commenting below um aquarius it looks beautiful i am praying for you pray for me as well take care guys